Welcome to Safe and Sound support videos brought to you by Safe and Sound Creative Technologies serving the East Tennessee area. In this video we're going to tell you how to install the Speco Camera Recorder app for an Android phone. The first thing you want to do is go into the Play Store, search for Speco Player, and then download this top one here. I already have it downloaded so I'm just going to press open. And on this first screen, you see the device list. You want to click Add a Device. Now you have two options up top. One is IP slash domain. The other one is DDNS. If you hit the drop down menu, the IP slash domain, that's the one that you will use if you are on your home network, the same network that the camera recorder is connected to. If you are away from your home, and on a different network, you would use the DDNS option. We're going to set up the DDNS option, so we're going to click on DDNS. All of this information on this page you can obtain from us. Please give us a call if you need the information for your system. We're just going to name it Test. And on the next option, uh, the IP DNS address it already puts in the last part of the address for you, so you only need the information at the beginning of it. So I'm going to key in the information for our test location. The next option is port ID. Just key in the information that you receive from us. And the line after that is the site ID. You will also get that information from us. And the next line is the password is the password that you were given by us. Once you type in your password, you hit save. And it takes you back to the main page. Now all you have to do is click on the location. And it will automatically load your cameras. Now that your cameras are loaded, if you want to make the camera bigger, all you have to do is double tap on the camera that you want to make bigger, and it will make it full size. You can also rotate your camera to make it true full size. To get back to all your cameras, just double tap the screen again. It will take you back to your main camera page. If you would like to view playback footage, all you have to do is press on playback in the upper right hand corner. It will connect to the recorder and ask you what day that you want to view footage from. Anywhere in blue is recorded. So we're going to go back to Saturday the 11th and then choose a time. We'll just go to 8 a.m. and press play. And now, now you see the recorded camera footage. You can press the play, pause, or fast forward buttons on the bottom if you want to scroll through the different footage. To get back to the live camera, all you do is press live in the upper right hand corner. And now you're back to the live screen. To get back to the main menu, just hit the back button on your phone and it takes you back to the device list. That completes the installation and setup of your Spico camera recorder app. For more support videos, please visit our YouTube channel or our website at safeandsound.com.